All right, you guys, so right now we're gonna attempt to make a Shopify store in under 10 minutes from complete scratch. I'm not gonna use any cuts in this video or anything like that. So we're literally gonna have 10 minutes on the clock and we're gonna get started building this store. I also wanna give the store that I create in this video away to one of you guys. Three, two, one, go. Boom. Skip all through these questions. We're literally starting from the base, like from literally ground one or whatever, level one. Kareem, blur that out if you can. Kareem's the editor, by the way, the boy. I know we're not cutting at this point, so <laughs> here, let's go, boom, boom. All right, so let's go to settings first, and then let's go ahead and go down to policies. I like to do all the settings stuff first, especially if I'm on a time limit like this. We're 25 seconds in, terms of service, privacy policy, save, boom. Now let's go and set up the markets. So let's go markets, let's go right here, international, boom, boom, remove this market. Let's go over here, let's add market. Let's go boom, 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 boom. Hey, did you not go? Here, uh, North America, Oceania, South America, worldwide. Boom, add market, sick. Now that we got this guy set up, this is out in our market, so now we'll be able to ship to basically the entire world. All we have to do now is set up our shipping. So now we're gonna go ahead and go to our shipping settings, and we're going to delete these guys, which are the just stock ones that are set up automatically. Remove these rates, we're gonna click save, and then we're gonna just click add rates, create zone. Let's do worldwide. We also gotta make sure US is selected. Let's do worldwide, done at rate right here i'm going to call this free vip insured shipping fix that boom add conditional pricing boom boom right here then we'll go ahead and click save on that guy right there so now we've got our shipping set up all done we've got everything boom gone right here click save this thing's being a little slow though my computer's being a little slow Sing better clutch up. All right, this the Wi-Fi better not be the reason we don't get this. Can't blame it on the Wi-Fi. Can't blame it on anything. This is in our control. Let's get it. All right, so boom, worldwide activated. Everything's activated. Zero countries are on your markets. Boom, we're good. All right, let's go to online store. Let's go to nav real quick. Let's get the footer menu looking good. So footer menu, let's call this more about us. More about us. Dot, 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 boom, and then let's add these items to it. So let's add the pages, contact, add, let's add the policies, privacy policy, policies, and service, boom, add, add, save. Let's go back. Now let's go to products. Let's add the products. So we're gonna go to this makeup brush cleaner. Or actually, we can just go right here. Let's go settings. Uh, online store, add apps, boom, let's go add apps, let's go Shopify app store. We're gonna set up Zendrop. I wasn't gonna set up a supplier in this video, but we're gonna set up Zendrop just because I feel like we're gonna be able to pull this off and might as well do it just to flex on them. So let's get it installed, boom, boom. <laughs> I was gonna just set up the product directly in Shopify just cause that's all you need to do if you're working with a private supplier, but Zendrop's obviously amazing to work with and what we're actually gonna be using. So I figured I'd just do it the full way, might as well. So makeup, so this is so easy. This ended up so easy to set up. All right, this is why I love this. So makeup cleaner, boom. Let's find this right there, literally add to import list. Boom, my products, import this to the store, review and publish, boom, boom, boom. Let's go, description, let's uh, grab this and let's throw it in chat GPT. So, and let's say make this better and more fun make this better and more fun. Boom. Sweet, so just right here, got this all done, going crazy, let's go. All right, sick, boom, boom. Throw this in the description section right here in Zendrop. Boom, product, we'll call this the automatic makeup brush cleaner. Automatic brush cleaner, let's call it the Call it the Beautify. Beautify. Is, well, that'll be the company name. Beautify Automatic Brush Cleaner. Boom, boom. Variants. Let's make this. Let's call it uh, forty nine ninety nine. Let's do it that price. Perfect. Boom, boom. And then we're just gonna use stock images, obviously, because we don't have the product on hand. Publish to my store. 
boom. And just like that, you guys, as you can see, we've got products. So now see this publishing. Let's wait until this thing says published. Let's go. Link. Boom. All right, sick, you guys. So now we've got the pro product inside the store right here. So now all we're gonna go ahead and do at this point is go back. We're gonna go online store. And now we're gonna go into Dawn and customize it. So we gotta have a logo for the header first. So let's go to Canva and let's make a logo. We're calling the store Beautify. So I'm just gonna go right here. We're just gonna call it Beautify. I like that font too, Loki. That looks kinda cool. I said Beautify, boom, boom. Yeah, we'll make it like a fun makeup store. It'll look like kind of fun. All right, so boom, right here. Let's grab this logo, transparent background. My store, boom. All right, now let's go over to header. Pull up down here, right to where the logo's at. Select image, drag and drop this guy, just like that. Boom, done. All right, sweet, we got the logo up in there. So now, next thing we're gonna do is change the color of this header. So let's change this to, change it to this scheme. We want it to be black. So let's go, wrong scheme right there. Let's change this one. Boom, right there, got that changed. Now let's go announcement bar. Let's do free shipping, free worldwide shipping on all orders. Boom, let's edit it in mobile view too. Free worldwide shipping on all orders. Let's go products, let's just link it to this. All right, sweet. And then let's go featured products. Let's delete this section, low key, let's add. Might as well just sauce it up, boom. Featured product, select the product right here. Let's go to the brush cleaner, select, save. Let's get rid of this little vendor thing right here. I don't like this little block, it's text. Get rid of that, boom. Save. All right, sweet. Now let's add. I always like to do this, you guys. I go ahead and add this little section right here. Just kind of make, makes it look good at the bottom of your website. So right here we go. And then we just take stuff from the description. So we literally just go to this chat GPT description and we take this paragraph and we go boom. And we go revolutionize, take the first word. Super simple. Boom, take the first word, go like that, right? Now we go second, boom, grab this one right here. It's core ball. Let's go this guy. Last one. Save. Multicolumn. Let's get rid of this. Let's go down here and let's add the button to this multi-column. So let's go button link. Let's go products. Oh, let's go shop now. Shop now. Boom, boom, boom. All right, sick, you guys. So now we gotta add this header right here. So let's go makeup, brush, cleaner. Boom, and then let's find if there's one of somebody using it. Go search image with Google. Boom. All right, right here, let's use this one. Done. Um, actually, let's go right here. Let's use this one. This is a good header photo. Just clean looking. Boom. Super clean. All right, let's drag this right here. Boom. X off. Image banner. Buttons, image banner. Boom. First image. Let's go right here. Let's browse our latest products. Go. Let's get rid of that. Buttons. Get yours. Get yours now. All products. Paste link. Boom, some products, let's go. I don't even have a second button, so I didn't even need to do that. Get yours now, boom, right there, done, done, done. All right, sweet. Now, last thing we gotta do is add the footer menu. So let's add the footer menu, boom, boom. Menu, more about us, save. All right, sick. Now let's go and head and just do the checkout just because we got time. You guys, I think we, I think we got a pretty good store set up. It's definitely set up and ready to, well, we'll see. We'll see, I'll keep it a secret. No, it's not a secret, I forgot. There's no cuts in this video. <laughs> Never mind. All right, you guys, I think we completed this challenge. Here, let's see. All right, boom, boom, boom. Background color, accents, errors. Buttons, white, 
errors, background color, boom, boom, boom. Okay, sweet, now let's go save. And now, let's just see if we can remove the Powered by Shopify in 10 seconds for fun. Edit code, let's go to a footer. Footer liquid, F. Ah, oh, shit. And the, stop, the clock has stopped. We definitely completed that challenge with enough time, you guys. Check out the store, so check this. So boom, as you guys can see, Beautify, free worldwide shipping on all orders, get yours now. We've got the product right here. We've got a little multi-column down here that explains a little bit more about the product. Nice little homepage, simple, straight to the point. This is what I recommend you guys make your stores look like. Simple, clean, to the point. Get yours now, boom, right here. We've got the product up here. We've got the description in here. Obviously, if we had more time, we would have added Giphy's. We would have taken custom product photos, done all that sort of stuff but with just using chat gpt we have a fire description this description would have probably taken somebody 30 45 minutes to write themselves so the fact that we made the entire store and have this description in here in under 10 minutes is crazy and it wouldn't have been possible without chat gpt right as you can see checkout looks fire we got our logo up there looks super dope it's working challenge complete let's get it